This is the whole the the oh shit bars in the dash, guys. Here we go. You want to transfer it? Hey, you, it's your truck, baby. Here's the switch. Oh, you want me to do the button? All right, I'm mashing the magic button here on the trans brake. Hold the button. Whenever you're ready, let it go. in Mr. Haney. This is John 66 Ford pickup truck. That is not a Ford anymore besides basically the body. Got a 392 64 Hemi in it. With the 46 RE transmission. That same basically the same thing that's in Frostbite with a trans brake, full manual valve body. Truck sounds Badass. Shit. I'm not gonna lie, it's a little scary. <laughs> trans brake or line lock? Hey, you give you do Fine, whatever trans you want. Brake. Trans brake button. That's just trans brake button. <laughs> trans brake. Hell yeah. Cold tires. I think we did a little rubber back there, guys. This is this thing literally feels like a dragster. Sounds like it sounds like a dragster. <laughs> but we're riding in an old school '66 Ford. That's just that's awesome. It's a mofo. It's a mofo. Half mo, half mo. It's half mo and half fo. He says it's a mofo. I like it. We gotta be careful in the neighborhood. Yeah. They're always giving me the stink eye. Oh, I'm sure they're probably seeing you go down the road. There's that damn coat boy yeah. again. <laughs> yeah, with the name on the phone number right in the side doors, it's not a good Easy thing. Easy to give you away, huh? Yeah. <laughs> and I have got calls. Was it you in that truck? <laughs> I always blame it on my son, even though he's never drove it. Hey, you want to race, Honda? the lock up on Haney. Right. Yours will be that way too. It's a little bit more pronounced in a, in a gas than it is in a diesel. Because it lugs it more. Because yeah. the diesel's only got like a 1200 stall. This has got a 4500 stall. So you really hear it. So yeah. when you when you go from stall to lock up it's, it's a pretty big difference. And plus that diesel has so much torque. Yep. It's, it's hard to not a huge difference like a gas engine. All right, we're out of the neighborhood. We can open her up. We're up to, we got some temperature in the motor now. I won't right. trans brake it though. This is the whole the, the oh shit bars in the dash, guys. Here we go. You want to trans brake it? Hey, you, it's your truck, baby. Here's the switch. Oh, you want me to do the button? All right, I'm mashing the magic button here on the trans brake. Hold the button. Whenever you're ready, let it go. Oh man. And then we're, the road we're on has like these little humps. 
Holy well, shit. Pete would have went airborne if I didn't lift. Oh yeah, yeah. No, we would have we would have been fucking probably in the phone poles up here. <laughs> Holy shit. This is nuts. It is a lot of fun. There, there's no doubt about that. Nah. The whole, the best thing about it is just literally when the gear changes, you, it's just. You feel it. Yeah. It is instant. It's instant. It's instant. That's it's instant. The, one of the best upgrades you can do to any transmission is put a reverse manual valve body in it. And if you got a Chrysler, put a CRT reverse manual yeah. valve body in it. Yeah. No, I mean, it's, it's, you can't even describe it. It's literally, it just feels freaking good. That's all I can say. When it goes in the gear, guys, it's bam in the gear, and you just feel the torque. Every gear, Every time, it's just the power's there and it goes in the gear. So that, that's the best way to put it. That's the best way to put it. And this 392 Hemi and this damn Mofo is uh, it's strong. You can feel it. It's strong. And it's bone stock. It's bone stock. It ain't even tuned. No tuner. All it's no got is an air cleaner. Air cleaner, drop-in crate motor, and a '66 Ford, and it hauls ass. I'm not going to lie, on that straightaway, <laughs> on that straightaway wide open, this well, thing felt like it was pulling damn near as hard as To be honest, it's got street tires on it, Yeah. and it's annihilating the shit out of the tires. Yeah, yeah. oh for sure. Yeah, but it pulls, it pulls like a freaking horse. Pulls like a horse. No doubt about that. Nuts. A 66 Ford didn't have that kind of punch out of the hole back then. No, not at all. <laughs> you had to pump the carburetor and get her going. Yeah, they're turning to Where's that trans brake? <laughs> oh shit, he wants to launch her again. Yeah, you gotta be careful, there's people behind Oh yeah, we got company back there. Dude, wait till you get in the frostbite with that converter. Fuck. It's the same trans, the same converter, the same gear ratio, the same bell body. You said this ran a what? A 12? Something? It only ran 1260s. A 12.6? Yeah. I'm telling you, this thing is pulling. <laughs> Every bit is as hard as frostbite. If not, it feels stronger. Yeah, it always does in a passenger seat. I don't know. I'm telling you, <laughs> when that 392 comes to life, that bitch is yanking. And I'm shipping at four or five grand. Well, I'm shipping about 5,200. Guys, I don't know. Hey, I may not. I'm, I'm probably not going to know what to expect when I got a transmission that's actually grabbing and not slipping. Yeah. You're putting the power to the pavement. Yeah. With the 46 and a reverse manual valve body. Yeah. You really are. <laughs> this thing pulls like a freaking horse. That's an understatement. That's an understatement. light up the throttle you'll never know it was you making all that noise right you know and what I'll do is that when we turn at this light I'll pull up a little bit and I'll put it in lock up before I shift so you feel how how, how it's, much firmer it, it, firmer it is and here again it's not gonna be like the diesel right okay because that's making 10 times as much torque as this thing does. Right. So it's, the torque is everything when it comes to firm shifts. Oh yeah.
So now it's in lockup. on the one two yeah yeah you can definitely feel a much bigger thud and i was going to put a bump box in there you ever watch uh street outlaws and oh, yeah, the turbo right. cars are pumping and pumping and yep. going in there my brake works so fast that they work really good with um the bump, with, bump right. with bump boxes and i was only going to put one on there just to see the truck humping and pumping yeah. before because anything you can do to distract the guy next to you, oh yeah, hey. it's a plus. So anything. Hell, I've learned that with with uh, purging nitrous. Yeah. You know, if they don't have nitrous and you're purging it, they're like, oh shit! You get in the their head. You get in their head. Yeah. yeah, you get in their head. I'll never forget a couple guys to tell me I don't like racing you. I'm like, why? Because because every time I see you do a three foot wheelie, I'm not concentrating on what I'm doing. I'm looking at you doing the wheelie. Yeah. Freaking awesome! Yeah, he I would say so I don't think in a million years I would have ever thought I'd be sitting in a '66 Ford or a Mofo <laughs> with a Hemi and uh, this bad transmission in it, man. That's definitely the best theme park ride I've been on right here. <laughs> you must be this tall to ride this ride. Yeah, literally, at least <laughs> must be. Please keep your hands yeah. in, in, the, in the car at all times and don't feed animals. Damn right. Now has this thing got uh is this got a, a spool in the back or is it no it's it's still limited slip? It's got a Detroit locker, I think is what okay. it's called. And it's always locked. No, that's why when we turn it, click, 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 say, click, click, click. It, yeah. Every time we go to a car show and they back in, they're like, you know, your U joints are bad. I'm like, you know, you're a dumbass. That's the Detroit locker. <laughs> oh god, here we go. Ooh. God All I'm doing is spoiling the tires. Oh, yeah, it's, so. it's it's the pavement's half wet, and it's cold as balls out here right now. Oh, we're on camera. Why did you say so? Uh-oh. Oh, the line lock ain't working. We probably lost it back there. Drain's really? breaking it. <laughs> Whoa, oh, shit. <laughs> we smoked the shit out of them you back there, guys. You can't see out the shop. You, you can't see out of the shop. You can't even see nobody outside. Bet you 20 bucks, the cops will be here in five minutes. Hey, I'm gonna go hide. You guys have a fun one. <laughs>